Hi everyone, this is George Thomas with CBN News. Uh, I am in a small village uh, just southwest of Ukraine's capital, Kyiv. Um, from this vantage point, I can hear uh, the constant uh, shelling, uh, multiple booms uh, that, uh, that you can hear uh, far off in the distance. Uh, we are almost three weeks into Russia's invasion of a major European uh, nation and its capital uh, as uh, Russian forces continue to attempt uh, to encircle uh, the capital uh, down in the south, down in the east, eastern parts of the country. The fighting is intense. Right now, all eyes are on Kyiv as uh, Russian forces come in from the uh, from the north, from the east, and from the west uh, in their attempts to, to close the capital, Kyiv, to surround it. Uh, today, I had a chance to speak at uh, this evangelical church here in the small village, and I shared with them uh, really the prayers of uh, thousands of people uh, who have written in their prayers to CBN, over the last three weeks, uh, praying for the nation of Ukraine, praying, praying for the Christians uh, here in the country, for the pastoral leadership, for the evangelical leaders. Uh, and, and I've had a chance to share some of those prayers uh, and to bring uh, a sense of um, um, uh, just comfort as best as I can in the midst of their difficult, difficult times. Uh, I spoke uh, of the passage in Paul where Paul says to the church in Ephesus to put on the full armor that when they do battle uh, in the physical, it's just like Ukrainian soldiers today, they are putting on their full armor. Uh, I use the same example to say that as believers, we uh, continue to pull on the full armor every day when we go out to do spiritual battle. And I just shared with the Ukrainians that as they put on their full armor and go out to do battle in the spiritual world, that uh, after they have done all of these things, Paul reminds us to stand, to not give up, despite the enemy's advances, to keep standing, uh, to not lose hope, to not be fearful. And so today, my message to the church here in Ukraine, in the small village, was not to give up. Uh, while they see the horrific images being played out on their screens, uh, I said uh, to them, I encourage them from a very humble position uh, to just keep standing. And so today, my message to you today uh, as well is whatever personal situation you are going through, uh, whatever circumstance that is happening in your life, uh, I encourage you, don't give up. Keep standing. Uh, God is not done. He's not done with your life. He's not done writing his story. Uh, uh, in your life. It's the same thing for the Ukrainians and for the nation uh, of uh, of Ukraine. God is not done uh, writing his story. I'm George Thomas reporting for CBN News.